Good morning everyone, welcome back. Today, I am just running around checking on the cows and everything. These ones need water and food, so I'm just going to top these up. Hopefully I'll get through this gate. There you go. Yes, so these cows need topping up. Um, another problem I've currently got is that chickens are out of food. So, oh, but there you go. Yeah, so I need to get some wheat or barley going. But mine's not ready yet. It's a long, long way off, so I'm probably gonna. Have buy some from somewhere just about it I'm gonna start working on that other field as well at my farm that I harvested the other day with these sunflowers the farm hopefully that's going the right way looks like it right these ones are okay for now they've got food they've got a little bit of straw So, I didn't realise as well that this Gwail uh, wrapper, baler thingy, can actually do TMR bales. So at some point I'm going to do that, just to see how we can move. That might be a lot easier. Just creating it like that. You can see the chicken are completely out of food. So egg production has stopped. And that means these little ones will not grow. I have nothing in there. Square bales, no. I need to get rid of them, they're going into food. So they I've got 131 hay bales there. A couple of pallets of eggs. Uh, I just ran into a wall. That's not very good. I still haven't touched this yet. I definitely want this full. Right, one thing I'm gonna do as well while I'm here. I'm going to sell this because it's never really active now that I'm using the manure for solid fertilizer and things like that it's no good silage I'm not too worried about using it for that at the moment because at the end of the day I am using that to do the um, cow feed. Right, now is the challenge. There you go, that's one. There should be three in total. There's two. Three. 
for me. And is that all of them? Yep. So now I've got this space here. I've been thinking about putting like a work shed down here so I can change tools and things like that. Like put wheels on them, tractors and stuff. So yeah. I thought if I have one workshop at each farm that means I can keep my maintenance and things like that. And I was also going to put a slurry tank down there. So that I can store the slurry. Because I will be eating pigs. Cows were harmed in this process. Uh, no, oh, I should be there. Trying to work out which site it is from. Oh, crashed. I'm the wrong way. If I remember rightly, it is this site. There you go. Yes, so using this obviously can be quite tricky. If I turn a load of TMR into bales, to me that makes more sense. I'll just go and drop them down or whatever. Just going to take all of that, that's good. Left. Also looking at the screen. Nearly done. Yes, yeah, so. Uh, new sales, uh, I ain't got to worry about that. I was thinking of poplars, so I might get these from the store. Now I've done grass, done hay, done chaff, silage, etc. I haven't done potatoes yet, grapes. I've done all the grains. So like the wheat, barley, canola, sorghum, sunflower. So I might put one of these first in that field. I don't know yet which one. So poplars will be wood chips. That requires getting a harvester, like a forage wagon, a uh, forage harvester. second farm oh, 
last time I've shot a game. So these are all fed now. The health will go up in a second or two. These seem to be pretty happy. Right, so... Yeah, I have a workshop here where I play around and put different wheels on tractors and stuff. So I was thinking of having one down at the other place as well. This field right now... Probably going to... Um, with a planter. So I'm going to do corn, done that, sunflower done that, soybeans done that. Now I've got these two here. Do you need to direct drill or can it direct drill? Okay we can. So we can do that now. Hang on, how much horsepower did I need? 370 Is that even 370 down there? 326, okay Let's do an engine upgrade or see how much an engine upgrade is Variable transmission, 66,000, and I gain over 100 horsepower. Yes, please, thank you very much. Right now, I can use this one. <coughs> right. So. Now I changed it to a drawbar instead of using the free bucket linkage on the planter just to make it easier to turn with a big articulated one. This should work just as well. Right, so I've got fertilizer. I'm going to change that. Sugar beets. Let me just check to see what I need to do. Sugar beets. So the tractor I got. So you need something to cut the tops and then something to collect. And that should be able to go into any trailer. What about cotton? Oh, we're going to do cotton. Why not? Cotton first. No, we won't. We'll do sugar beet on this one, and then when we get a big field, we're doing cotton on the big field. So, what I'm going to do is get rid of that menu so I can see everything. Because. I'm going to do this one myself. This is a big bit of equipment. So this should not take long to do at all.
takes a long time to unfold it. One thing I will have to do is use a bit of guided steering cars. This is going to be wide. Um, I need to rotate. So. That's good. Lower the cedar. Turn on the cedar. Oh, it's a bit laggy there. Here we go. I'm good to go. Hopefully that's doing a good job. Good. So we got weeds growing. It's not too bad because I can use my herbicide in my sprayer. Yeah, look how much of an area I'm covering with just one pass. It's probably only going to take like five passes at max. And the tractor's now even struggling to pull it, which is even better. I like this sale. So if we've got sugar beets in this field as well now, that's another crop that we took out and it's usually a high yielding crop. So is it all perfect when we go back in? We are good and perfect. So pH we need to get up a bit more but that's just line so I'm not too worried about that just yet right. I'm stop there because I don't want to run over my other field do a very bad job of spinning around drop that down and off we go again and then what I'll do is I'll just go around the edge at the end and that'll be done. So 
to this end down here does not really matter because it's not my field. And uh, there's nothing growing in it just yet. First crop in it, I'd like on like stage three or something where it's just coming out of the ground, that would probably be a different story. field. There we go, job done. Raise that. What is actually in this field? So the sugar beet as well. Okay. That was not planned. Oh. Okay. That is obviously quite close to the fence. So that's going to be five passes like I predicted, so that's good. And now we have something different on the farm. Now the next thing is where can I store it? Because you can't store root crops in the silo, so I've still got to work that one out as well. And then I've got the fun of working out what I can do with it. As in productions. I know you can turn it into sugar cubes or however you want to put it. I don't know what mods are on here. What things you can do with it. Oh, and snaking. Ah, nearly. So, just got to go down that row there, and I'm done. And, yeah, didn't think that would work. At least this plant plant on this tractor turns really really sharply. So I was a bit concerned about using it on this field, but I don't really need to be. It works really, really well. So turn that, turn that. that other field there. <coughs> so that is one field done. Nice, quick and easy. Just gonna go to the right a bit there just in case. Right. Job done. Cool. 
come on. Ah, oh, it is folding, it just takes its time. So, weeds are growing. to be done. I'm going to turn that periodic rolling on or off if I've got it on here. No, I haven't. That must be my other mod folder. Anyway, I might roll it because it's not going to take too long. I'd probably do it off screen. It would literally take me just as long as it did to do that, right there. Oh, I've got herbicides, they're all herbicides. So that's all for the weeders. This one up here. And by me. take much to do this now if I had ploughed it originally and used the normal routine that I do with the cultivating and everything else I wouldn't get weeds I think that's like the first time I've used that planter like that, so yeah. It's good to try things out. Weeds are not gonna be an issue about her side anyway, so I've still gotta buy some more. Thing. Put this one away. So, what fields have I got growing at the moment? 109 is pretty much ready to go. So, that one's going to be a cotton field, I think. Everything else is pretty fresh. I need to sort the chickens out now. Oh, watch the beans. So... I need a post. I need a trailer. Oh, that's two crashes. Oh, hello. It's a bit unstable. Alright, let's back this in here. How well did I do? That to me. So I'm just trying to work out if I can buy grain here. Not sure. I think you can definitely dump it. So Um, 
worry about them. Super sharp steering. to this shot. You should be able to do it from there. You should be able to do it. There you go. Have to think about that. No. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? Oh, okay. It's one thing I hate about this. Because I haven't quite worked out yet with the auto drive, it does go bits like that. It just goes to the nearest path. Yeah, that do. Now go. So I need chicken feed. Uh, seed, mineral seed. Not that one. Big bags. Oh, that's expensive. That's really expensive for what it is. Right, that should see me through for now. I'll go with that. done this a while. that bale into TMR at some point so I'll leave that there. So basically what I'm doing is using all these square bales that I've got here. Keeping these ones. I'm trying to turn everything into round bales. So what have I got? I've got hay, hay and straw so Probably going to turn like 
the straw because it's the most empty into TMR. Just use that the silage bales here and these square bales and just load them into this. Next episode, something like that, maybe. But what I'm going to do right now is construction. I need to work out what I can put here. Do I really need another bale shed? I don't know. No, I don't need that. Store digestate. Hmm. I'm definitely going to need another workshop, so let's get one of them in. I don't want that one. Let's have that one. Let's change the rotation to that. Actually, that could go there. That makes more sense to me. So I can have that there. I need to get... Pipe production, no. See, I don't really need to use these anymore, so that's out of the question. I think I'm good for factories. So basically all I'm looking for is silos. The question is which one? That would be. That's my liquid manual and digestate. So that's storage for that. Normal manual I should be all right for there's no way I'm getting five million or two million liters of manure so I'm gonna keep that there for now like that so I can top that up I've got my vehicle thingy here right, for the workshop <coughs> right let's hopefully see that I can load these into here I hope we can yes I'm going to feed the chickens, I'm going to call that an episode. I was going to keep it down to half an hour this time, but I've gone a bit overboard again. Which 
I'm pretty good at by the look of it. So let's go to second farm silo. Or wherever he's going. Ah, oh, he's just turning around, okay. Okay. I'll leave him to it. Ah, why is that liquid fertilizer when it should be? Oh, no. Okay. Well, that has to be emptied now. I wasn't reading at the bottom of the screen there. Mistakes happen. Right. Yeah. So, I'm just gonna chuck that in there, chuck that in there, chuck that in there, chuck that in there. Can I get my herbicide out now? Yes, thank you very much. Right, so this is going well. Where's my tractor? It's getting there. So that's ready to go. I don't know if I can spray it now. Oh, I ain't got a clue. That can go off. This seems to be in the middle of nowhere now because it looks weird without a big biogas plant here. But yeah, you get that sometimes. Here he comes. Right, so this one is grow stage 8 out of 8, so this is going to be cut next episode. This is 3 of 6. I'm just going to jump into this tractor. Turn that off. Yeah, this is just going to go straight into that pen. I'll do that in a sec. Chuck that. Feed. Job done. Chickens are now fed. They've only got eight thousand liters, but that should keep them going for now. I've run into a wall because. I'm stupid. 
so yeah we've had a bit of a transformation again on the farm it's always chopping and changing so yeah i'm gonna leave it there thank you for watching please subscribe and goodbye for now